Hello and welcome back to Hard Reset Info. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Object Eraser on Samsung Galaxy A56. Let's begin! First of all, we want to locate a photo that we want to edit. Let's say I'm going to edit this one. Uh, I just took it moments ago. And let's say I am no longer a fan of this white. Uh, logo version right here. I want to remove it from my photo and I can easily do that by going into edit and clicking the pencil icon and here going to the little uh, smiley face icon at the bottom. Oh, actually it's not the smiley face, it's those four dots on the, uh, the right corner and the very first option is object eraser. We simply hit it and now we can, now after a while, uh, we can automatically erase something. Um, the AI says that it wants to erase something in the background. I am not even asking questions, but I am not going to do that. Instead, I'm going to, I can actually, oh, good. Uh, we can automatically erase shadows, erase reflections. However, I'm going to circle this little uh, icon here and as you can see it uh, automatically adjusted itself into the shape now we simply hit erase and well it's gone except it's not gone really so let's try to uh, to erase it once again good it worked now the white logo is no more. Um, that's technically the end of the tutorial, uh, but I'm wondering how uh, how much does how much this AI tool can handle. Uh, let's try to erase the little logo we have on the background. I wonder if it will. Oh, it did detect it. Let's it erase. Okay, it's. Okay, you can see that uh, the little texture here is a bit different than... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, that the texture here is a bit different than one on the over here. But it is a nice, it is pretty good job. And lastly, the final test. Can it automatically erase the little plant uh, right in the middle of the photo? Let's try and see. Hit erase. Okay, now we have to only erase the shadows. So let's circle the shadow here. Let's hit erase once again. Oh, that doesn't look very good. Let's try that once again. Hmm, that's interesting. Uh, we can try to... The erase shadow option is gone. Uh, so I'm guessing it only works on the default uh, on the default version without uh, really changing anything. It is pretty interesting that it doesn't want to erase this little bit of shadow. It looks really bad though. I'm not gonna not going to lie. Um, however, let's try to hit done. Uh, let's try to save it. Uh, we can go to save and now the uh, original is gone. We don't care about that Instead, let's go back into the pencil icon Let's go back into these four dots here and let's try to like restart the option now the erase shadow uh, Is here. So let's try to erase shadows And let's see if the little oh it worked nice now we simply hit done and we hit save. I actually screwed up. I could have saved it as a copy so we could have like a side to side comparison. Uh, but you can always just rewind back to the beginning of the video to see the original photo. But as you can see, the erase, uh, the object eraser is a really powerful tool. Uh, it's not powerful like at all. Uh, it does have limits, like everything, but for a simple removing stuff from the background, it works really, really well. I'm honestly quite surprised. 
But yeah, that's all for this video. If you found it useful, please remember to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.